Welcome back to It's Giving Taiwan. I'm Angela. I'm Monica. Before you come to Taiwan, there are four things you need to know. With our tips, your trip in Taiwan will be very smooth and easy. In this video, we will cover Taiwan's climate, transportation, payment method, and regional features. Without further ado, let's get into it! Knowing the climate of the place you are about to travel to is very important. So we can prevent unexpected situations. You know, living in Taipei is very frustrating because it almost rains all four seasons. It's true. Which is why an umbrella is a necessity. We bring umbrellas everywhere we go. Speaking of four seasons, I don't think there are actually four seasons in Taiwan. True. During summer, it's as hot as you, Angela. Sunlight is unbearable. Every time when I walk outside, I immediately start sweating. My boyfriend, Wesley, when he came to Taiwan in summer for two months, and he was just outdoor for two days, and he got seriously sunburned. Which is why sunscreen will be your best friend. You'll need sunscreen all the time. Also, from July to August, it's typhoon season, so be aware of strong wind and pouring rain, and avoid outdoor activities or else. It's cold as fuck. A lot of foreigners thought it is not that cold since Taiwan is in a subtropical area. It's true. Taiwan is actually very cold during summer. Even though we don't really get any snow, the humidity and the strong wind will make you feel even colder. So if you think you only need to bring your summer wear to Taiwan, then you are dead wrong. Congratulations! You finally landed in Taiwan! After you walk out of the airport, there are several different ways to commute. There are HSR, subways in some cities, buses, local trains, and taxis slash Ubers. If your destination is Taipei, the most efficient way to get there is Taoyuan Airport MRT. And then you can transfer to other lines to get to your final destinations. And if your destination is southern Taiwan, we recommend you to take the HSR. And if you need a more affordable way, local trains are always your best friend. But the travel time might be slightly longer. However, if you arrive in Taiwan at a later time, the transportation we just mentioned might not be operating at the time. So the alternative will be buses, taxis, or Ubers. Taiwan's biggest selling point is our food stand culture. Most of the food stands in Taiwan, they do not take cash. So remember to bring some cash with you just in case. Besides our food stands, most of the stores here do take credit cards, debit cards, and other electronic payments. Also, one thing I love about Taiwan is you don't need to tip here. Northern Taiwan generally has city views. As you know, our capital city, Taipei, is located here. If you're a big city folk like I am, you'll love Taipei. Southern Taiwan is famous for its various food and historic sites. Tainan is especially known for that. Also, Kaohsiung is a massive port city in Southern Taiwan. East Taiwan is also known as Taiwan's Hawaii. People often go there to enjoy the beautiful natural scenery, such as Taroko National Park and Qingshui Cliff. That's all for today! We hope this video is helpful, and if you have any questions, feel free to comment down below. We'll reply, and see you in the next video! Bye!